good morning students so today we again repeat the chapter area related to circle so in this chapter mainly we need two formulas already you know the area of circle or perimeter of a circle as not it or perimeter means also we know as a circumference so first of all if you see the area of a circle so area of a circle formula all of you know pi r square is not it and the perimeter of a circle perimeter of a circle we know to pi r this to the main formula here actually in the chapter what we have to do with related to circle suppose different different types of shapes are there and we have to identify we have to find out the area as well as we have to find out the boundary that is the circumference we have to find out so already we discussed this chapter and the whole questions are already we have done but lots of confusion you have so that's why we have to repeat this chapter again and now here one by one question or the formulas we have to discuss separately here properly and let's see how can we do so now if we see the different different types of examples suppose if you see a bangle if you see a round cake if you see a popper is not it so different different types of shapes are there which are related to circle so here if suppose we consider an example area related to circle here mentioned suppose a triangle given here and with respect to this one circle is there and if anyone asks you find out the area of this person so how can we find out the area of this person because you see if you separately see the diagram this one is the circle and with respect to this triangle how can we find out the area of this person in this type of question sir we have to discuss here is it clear so mainly here what we need we need the area of circle as well as area of uh, sorry the perimeter of a circle all of you know that these two formulas now let's start how can we do this one this two let's see and one more thing the value of pi in different different places we use the value of pi sometimes we use 22 by 7 is not it sometimes we use pi equal to 3.14 depending on the question depending on the question we have to find out the value uh, we have to use the value in different different way isn't it so let's start here the example so now if you see the first question if you see the first question from the exercise 12.1 so if you see the first question from the exercise 12.1 the first question is given here the radius of two circles are 19 centimeter and 9 centimeter respectively so here what we have to do find the radius of the circle which has circumference equal to the sum of the circumference of two circles so now first of all here exercise 12.1 if you see the exercise 12.1 so in this case exercise 12.1 if you see the first question now in this case two circles are given of two different shape suppose one circle is this one so here we have to draw one circle and another circle is suppose this one so this circle radius is given 9 centimeter and another circle suppose the radius is given 19 centimeter is that it in this first question this two are given so 9 centimeter and 19 centimeter two circles are given here so what you have to do find the radius of the circle which has the circumference equal to the sum of these two circumference so that means what you have to do in this case we have to find out the radius of this circle here and for this circle we don't know the radius this circle we have to find out the radius if we consider the radius is r here and the question is given what the circumference of this circle plus the circumference of this circle we have to find out the circumference of these two circles and we have to equalize with this circle a to the circular i mean circumference to equal according to our question 
distal circle ए दो तरह circular जी तो circumference होला वो एक पॉइंट पिसर ये circumference तो कार्ल वाट equivalent point यार लगा यार लगा कोई दिया मतलब के जी तो result होला वो ये तो हमार तार पर हमें radius तो ले आओ पड़े is it clear so now suppose if we consider the radius this one is in general if we consider the radius is suppose we consider r1 here radius to me r1 boli hoi lo and if you consider the radius is suppose this one is r2 if we consider this one is r2 now we have to find out the circumference of this circle plus we have to find out the circumference of this circle and we have to add this two and we have to equal it this one so what is the circumference of this circle here circumference kiman the circumference of a circle is 2 pi r we know the formula the formula is a 2 pi r so that means in this case the circumference we have to write 2 pi r1 because the radius we consider r1 and r1 means how much 9 centimeter similarly in this case the circumference we have to write 2 pi r2 because we consider the radius is here what r2 is not it so that's why here the circumference radius is what 19 centimeter in place of r2 we have to write 19 centimeter and the third case in place of this one the circumference what you have to write we have to write 2 pi r because we don't know the radius so that's why we have to write this one okay now after writing this three circumference here 2 pi r1 2 pi r2 2 pi r According to our question, what you have to do? We have to add this to circumference and equal it this one. So that's why what you have to do, just you see here, according to the question, according to the question, what you have to do? 2 pi r1 plus 2 pi r2 equals to 2 pi i. Now is it clear? According to the question, the circumference of this two circle equally this one, third one. So 2 pi, 2 pi, 2 pi taking common and cancel with this. So here R1, R2 remains. So easily we can calculate this result. So you have to just put the value of R1 value is 9 centimeter, R2 is 19. And then if you put, then from here you get the radius of this circle. Is it clear? I think all of you understood this one now? Okay. Now, here we start the second question and the second question is given the ready of two circles are 8 centimeter and 6 centimeter respectively find the radius of the circle having area equal to the sum of the area of the two circles so that means what you have to do here the same question in the earlier question the perimeter given now in this case we have what we have to do we have to find out the area so two circles we have to consider and these two circles First of all, we have to find out the area and these two area we have to add and we have to equal with another circle. Very simple question. So same thing here what you have to do. Suppose first of all, we have to consider a circle with some radius given here and this one is we consider suppose R1. And similarly here we have to consider another circle and here with radius, this radius is we consider here suppose R2. Now in this case, these two radius are given to us. That's not it. These two radius are given 8 centimeter and 6 centimeter. So that's why this R1, if we consider this one is 8 centimeter. And the second one we have to consider, suppose this one is 6 centimeter. These two are given to us. Now this two circle we have to consider. And with respect to this, we have to consider another circle. Suppose this one is the circle here we have to consider. And this radius we don't know. And which one we consider, suppose R. Or you can consider a small letter R also, no problem. So if you consider this one is R, now according to our question, what you have to do? We have to find out the area of this circle, first of all. So area, we have to write here pi R1 square. That's not it. And the second one here, the second one is this one. So we have to consider this one is pi R2 square. And if pi R square and pi R2 square, if we write in the third case, we have to take this one is pi R square, the area of circle. So now according to our question, what given? So area of this circle plus area of this circle. The sum of these two circle is equal with the third one. Is not it? So that's why according to our question, what you have to write? According to the question, what you have to write? The area of first circle. Which one we have to write? Pi R1 square. 
plus second one we have to write pi r2 square and the sum of these two areas are equal with the third one third one is which one pi r square so that's why we have to write this one is pi r square isn't it so in this case you see here pi easily we can cancel here pi co taking common and cancel with this now here r1 square r2 square and r square so here if you see r1 value given so we have to put here r2 is given so we have to put here and then if you calculate this one then easily we get the value of r from here is not it so in this way very easily we can solve this second question is it clear okay so now we start the question number three the third question so as you see here the diagram given the third question in question number three the diagram if you see this smaller part is the gold part here then after that this one is the red part and then blue black and white these parts are given here first of all now in this case what you have to find out we have to find out the area of each person that means this white part if you see this part this part is white here we have to find out the area of this person as well as we have to find out the area of this black part this blue part red part and also we have to find out the area of this gold part so in this case if we start from this gold part now first of all now if you see we have to find out the area of this gold part so for area this one is a circle here so obviously what we need we need the area of circle in this case area the formula of area of circle is what pi r square in this case what given for the gold part diameter given diameter is how much 21 centimeter given here so if diameter is 21 centimeter so easily we can find out the radius here is not it so that's why one by one we have to start here so first we have to write for gold part so now here the diameter if we represent by d so which one we have to write 21 centimeter so radius easily we can find out radius is what the half of the diameter is not it the radius is half of the diameter so that's why we have to write r equal to d by 2 so that means if we write this one 21 by 2 or ultimately this one what we have to get what we get here 10.5 centimeter is not it so now here the radius radius we get here 10.5 centimeter so if radius 10.5 centimeter we get here as you see here we get 10.5 centimeter so easily we can find out the area now so area how can we write area equals to pi r square is not it so pi we can write 22 by 7 or also we can write here 3.14 your choice or you keep the pi same also so if we write pi here radius how much 10.5 so into 10.5 into 10.5 and then if you put the value of pi equal to 3.14 or 22 by 7 you can calculate this result and from here easily you can find out the value of area of this gold part is it clear so in this way easily we can find out the area of this gold part next after finding the gold part here the next part is if you see here what we need we need the red part so already we get the gold part here is not it so if you see here if you see we need this portion only which portion we need we need this portion only this one is the red part here so if this one is the red part here how can we find out the area of this person so as a whole if you consider this one is the center and if you take this whole part this one is what the radius say properly i'm keeping a center law here by a to end the like this person this person if you consider now here in this case from the center this part is what this part is radius so as a whole we can find out the area of this whole circle can we find out easily we can find out and then if we subtract the area of this goal part if we subtract the area of this goal part then which part remain here this shaded portion remain is it clear i mean keep going first of all yeah central level good red part or circle as a area to william good part to area to william area to the other car park minus coding a goal part to minus coding if you subtract this goal part then we get this shaded portion the same process we have to do for blue black and white also 
clear baki eta moi kori diya nai baki eta tumalke nije kori loba just we have to see, you see here eta silo red part to kene ke hoy so now in this case in this case how can we find out the red part first of all we need the area of the red part so first of all to find out the area of the red part what we need we need the radius so now you see here from this portion to this portion this one is the goal part yeah radius to me already jano kiman the radius of this goal part is 10.5 and the y is how much already given in your question how much 10.5 so 10.5 plus 10.5 this one is the radius so that's why if you consider radius r that's why we have to write 10.5 plus 10.5 is it clear all of you understood this buji paisa na to this portion is 10.5 and this portion is again 10.5 so 10.5 plus 10.5 here we get this total 21 cm so easily we can find out the area now here so area equal to how much we get here area equal to pi r square so pi means 3.14 r means here 21 so 21 into 21 and if you calculate the area of this whole part you get here now we need this only this part this shaded portion amak yar he area lage we need the area of this portion so what you have to do from the whole part from the whole part if we subtract this goal part then we get the area of this shaded portion is it clear okay very simple very easy here so is it in this way we can find out the shaded portion i think all of you understood this one solution already given to you so in this way you have to proceed this blue black and white also pari mane koribo okay so our next question is question number 4 and the question number 4 is very interesting question here a circle given to you with diameter 80 cm and the circle circle means this one is actually a wheel of a car এখন গাড়ির এটা চকা এটা দিয়ে আসলে সেইটো কিমান দিয়ে আসলে তোমাৰ ডায়মিটাৰ দিয়ে আসলে তোমাৰ এইটি চেণ্টিমিটাৰ এইট জিৰ' এণ্ড নাও হিয়ৰ আফটাৰ টেন মিনিটছ ইন দ্য স্পীড অফ ছিক্সটি ছিক্স কিলোমিটাৰ পাৰ আৱাৰ ছিক্সটি ছিক্স কিলোমিটাৰ পাৰ আৱাৰ স্পীডত আফটাৰ টেন মিনিটছৰ পিছত সেই গাড়ীৰ সেই চকাটো কিমানটা পাক মাৰি পেলাই কমপ্লিট ডেষ্টিনেশ্যনটো পাবগে তাৰ নিজৰ জেগাত পাবগে আমি সেইটো উলিয়াব লাগে That means very simple. Sokato zodi khoru hoy. To obviously he basic ek ghori ghori ek bahi jabo lego. Aro zodi sokato zodi dhangor hoy. Chitale kam ghori le hi gaple pabogen. Ita tum amar ya question tu koshe je 66 km per hour the speed or he sokato ei 10 minute or kiman pak ghori bo. Sokato ei kiman pak ghori ba ami hato find out koye bolai. That means we have to find out the complete revolution here. Is it clear? For this. First of all, we need the circumference. So, cast to circumference to kiman. I am here to first tell you about it. So, our main task is we have to find out the circumference. So, circumference to tell you about corner here diameter to give us. Already solution given to you. Solution to tomorrow give us. For that reason, here we directly solve the answer here. My dear, sort of like this. So, diameter is 80 centimeter. So, that's why radius. Diameter by two. That means 80 by two equals to this one is 40 centimeter. Is that it? So now here, radius we get. Radius equal to how much? 40 centimeter. So if radius is 40 centimeter, so easily we can find out the circumference here now. I mean circumference will be over. Circumference equal to two pi r. So if circumference equal to two pi r. ইয়াত আমি ভেলুবিলাক যদি পুট কৰি দিওঁ টু ইনটু টুৱেণ্টি টু বাই ছেভেন অৰ ইউ জাষ্ট কিপ পাই ছেম পাই ইনটু ফৰ্টি অৰ ডেট মিন্স দিছ ওৱান হাউ মাছ ইউ গেট হিয়াৰ এইটি পাই চেণ্টিমিটাৰ ডেট মিন্স ওৱান কমপ্লিট ৰিভলিউশ্যন তাৰমানে চাৰ্কল চকাটোৱে যদি গাড়ীৰ চকাটোৱে যদি এক পাক ঘূৰে তেতিয়াহ'লে কিমানখিনি ডিষ্টেঞ্চ কভাৰ কৰে এইটি পাই ইজ ইট ক্লিয়াৰ ভেৰি ছিম্পল হিয়াৰ নাও নেক্সট ওৱান এতিয়া আমাৰ মেইন টাচটো হ'ল চকাটো এনেকে ঘূৰি কিমান ডিষ্টেঞ্চ কভাৰ কৰিব চ' ডিষ্টেঞ্চ নট মেনচন হিয়াৰ ডাইৰেক্টলি ইন প্লেচ অফ ডিষ্টেঞ্চ হোৱাট মেনচন হিয়াৰ হিয়াৰ মেনচন দ্য স্পীড চ' লেটছ ইজ দ্য স্পীড হিয়াৰ চ' আমি যদি ইয়াত স্পীডটো যদি চাওঁ 
if you see the speed speed given 66 kilometer per hour speed to dia says 66 kilometer per hour that means a ghanta 66 kilometer cover correct but here the units are given in centimeter as well as in minutes because amar je tu question level dise 10 minute or pisot kiman part maribo hetu he level dis so for that reason we have to convert this one into centimeter as well as we have to convert this hour into minute so we keep 66 into so now you see here hour that means one hour one hour equal to we need minute so that's why we have to write one hour equal to 60 minutes and kilometer we have to convert this kilometer into what centimeter so one kilometer equal to 1000 meter and one meter equal to 100 centimeter so that means we have to write this a kilometer equal to 1000 meter 1000 meter one meter equal to 100 centimeter so ultimately a to equal to my kilometer conversion and if you calculate this one then we get one one zero 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 i think uh, centimeter per minutes is it clear so solution already given to one silo but that was a calculation mistake as a coil over so now here what is the meaning of this one centimeter per minute per minute that means here meaning is what eight minute of iman kini distance cover for it centimeter per minute eight minute of iman kini distance cover for it so eight minute per minute that means eight minute of one 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 two three four centimeter the meaning of this line eight minute or iman kini distance cover kore in one minute aru ama kiman minute or kane uliya boli dise for ten minutes so ten minutes so in ten minutes what you have to write in ten minutes what you have to write so just you have to multiply this one by ten so that's why eleven one two three four into ten and then we get the total distance is it clear so this one is the total distance we get after getting the distance now one complete revolution that means sokato is the ek pa ghore titel amar result ki man asile 80 pai asile so number of uh, their revolution ki man kini pa ghori se ami ki man pa ghori se ami hetu gom na pao so that's why if we consider number of turn there I'm actually question to get you label they say how many complete revolutions so complete revolution we don't know so that's why here one revolution but we know 80 pi so if we consider the complete revolution is n and this complete revolution equal to one revolution equal to 80 pi at a revolution or among who is 80 pi I mean, Kimanta revolution is a Migomna Pong, Hekanami Tat put Koilo. If we consider the complete revolution, number of revolution is n, so that's how we write n, n into 80 by, and the total distance, whatever the cover, the total distance is this one. So this one equal to what? We have to write 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And if we calculate, then from here, the value of n we get here. Is it clear? So in this way, easily we can find out the number of times how many times the complete revolution the wheel of the complete revolution we have to find out easily in this way from here is it clear i think all of you understood so in our next class we start from area of sector and segment we have to discuss there and now your task is you have to complete these four questions properly or if any questions are there then easily you can ask me is it clear okay